One of the most remarkable events in the history of the world happened on the road to Damascus. You know well the story of Saul, who had made havoc of the church, entering into every house, committing the saints to prison. But as he came near Damascus, suddenly there shined round about him a light from heaven. And he fell to the earth and heard a voice saying unto him, Saul, Saul, why persecutest thou me? This transformative moment changed Saul forever. Indeed, it changed the world. There are some who feel that unless they have an experience similar to Saul's, they cannot believe. They wait at the threshold of testimony but cannot bring themselves to acknowledge the truth. Instead of taking small steps of faith on the path of discipleship, they want some traumatic event to compel them to believe. But there was something missing, because there was questions I had about doctrine. There are many others who, for different reasons, find themselves waiting on the road to Damascus. They delay becoming fully engaged as disciples. The gospel wasn't always an active part of my life, and there's a difference when you have that knowledge and when you have that conversion every day in your life. Some days it's only a moment, but it's those moments that make all the difference because you know that He's there. The truth is, those who diligently seek to learn of Christ eventually will come to know Him. They will personally receive a divine portrait of the Master. You know, this guy came over and invited us to church. He said, why not? And we started going, and the missionaries started coming by. And we worked the missionaries over with questions, because I had lots of them. I think being reconverted is consciously making choices every day that will lead you in the path that you want to go in. You know, I, I knew it wasn't going to be a, you know, Saul Paul kind of conversion. For six months, we, we read, we did everything, we went to church, and finally they asked, are you ready to make the commitment? And so we became baptized, and it was like we, we belonged. This is where we belonged all along. I know that God lives and that He loves us. We are His children, and I think that knowledge alone is priceless. Now, all my questions are answered, and I understand and I believe fully and truly in Jesus Christ. Let us not wait too long on our road to Damascus. Instead, let us courageously move forward in faith, hope, and charity, and we will be blessed with the light we are all seeking upon the path of true discipleship. <laughs>